What's going on everybody? It's Brian for jailbreakzone.com and in this video I'll be showing you how to install the AT&T carrier logo that you can see on my iPhone 4 in the upper left corner. Now this tweak has been available for quite a long time but with the recent versions of iOS the person who made this package originally has never updated it to take advantage of this so basically I'll be showing you how to manually get this to work. Now I do apologize for my poor lighting in this video. Uh, the power just went out about five minutes ago so you'll have to just live with it. So the first thing you need to do is to go into City and search for AT&T. Then you're going to find AT&T Carrier Logo for iPhone 4. You basically need to install this and you're also going to need a copy of iFile which is also available in Cydia. So after you've installed those things from Cydia you need to go ahead and open up iFile then you need to go back all the way to the root of your device. Then you, need to, then you need to go into System, Library, Carrier Bundles. Now here you're going to see two folders, AT&T underscore US dot bundle and iPhone. So you need to go into the AT&T US folder. Then you need to copy the two PNG files that are inside of that folder. Then you need to copy. Basically you just need to copy those two uh, PNG files into the slash iPhone, so system library or carrier bundles iPhone. Then you also need to find the AT&T US folder from here. There's a whole bunch of carriers, so it might may take a little while for you to find the AT&T US bundle. Then you just need to paste in those two PNG files and overwrite them. Then if you'd like, you could go back to your carrier bundles folder and remove the AT&T underscore us dot bundle folder or you can remove this package from Cydia then all you need to do is respring and your new carrier logo will then be working so I'm not too sure why the original person who made this package hasn't updated it yet I mean it, it's just a really quick update for him but oh well this is an easy alternative to get that to work so if you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, you can leave them down below in the comments area. But that's about it with the video, so thanks a lot for watching, and I'll talk to you guys soon.